Hello everyone, welcome to Northern Germany. We're on the city of Wolfsburg at the Volkswagen Arena. I'm Derek Ray here on the commentary box and I'm joined for commentary by Lee Dixon. And we have live action from the Bundesliga coming right up. It is Wolfsburg facing RB Leipzig. Thanks, Derek. I'm sure both coaches will want their players to start with a real zip in their play. Really show the opposition what they're in for. That could lead to fireworks. Let's hope so. And so the starting lineup for Wolfsburg. And this is a formation most people in the game are very familiar with nowadays. Yeah, most coaches are adopting this formation. What it does give you is two holding players in front of the back four to protect them. But it also gives you three supporting players to that central striker. Now let's have a look at the starting 11 for Leipzig. Peter Gulacci is the goalkeeper of choice. Marcel Zabitzer plays alongside Kevin Campbell in central midfield. And it's an interesting looking attacking constellation with three forwards listed from the start. And the match begins. Read it well. They've lost it. What can they do from here? Oh, a perfectly timed pass. Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. And the referee has given them a corner. And firing it into the area. Competent goalkeeping. Yeah, right place at the right time. Foils the attacker. Marcel Zabica. On to Mugiele. Well, unable to bend his run. Offside. Arnold Maximilian Philipp might be able to get in behind the defence and Philipp it did appear that they might be onto something but not so Marcel Zabica Andre Silva here's Mukiele Tackling and winning the ball to boot. Danny Olmo. Marcel Zabica. This looks promising out wide. There to take it away. And space to exploit, maybe. Well thumped clear. Marcel Zabica. And room now out on the flank. And teammates to play it to. Nordi Mukiele. Still passing it around with authority. He's given it straight to the opposition.
Andre Silva. And now with Angelino. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw in. Andre Silva. Can he put them in front? What a vital intervention. Take it away. The referee correctly decided to play advantage. Nkunku moving into the advanced position. Oh, that's an interesting pass. And just slightly offside. Andre Silva. Now with Orban. Nkunku. Orban. Well, they keep the ball moving. Good looking sequence. And smart defending. Showing a real desire to win it back. Angelino. Halstenberg has it. Danny Olmo. Lovely ball over the top. The importance of that tackle cannot be overstated. Maximilian Philipp. Now with Wechhorst. Schlager. And it's Maximilian Philipp. Strong but fair tackle. He can't hold on to it. Oh, a majestic finish! He's going to be rightly proud of that moment. Magnificent! Let's have another look at this. He wasn't expecting the ball, but when it comes to him, he chooses early to volley it. What a finish. A chance to revisit the goal. And with that, the first half draws to a close. Well, he wasn't quiet, was he, in the first half, about Wechhorst. Lee, what did you think of what he put into the game? Well, his manager will be delighted with him. He's been spot on in this game, hasn't he? Energy, imagination, desire, and a steely determination. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Kevin Campbell. Nkunku. Andre Silva. The hosts really haven't had too much of the ball, but again, we've seen it before, we'll see it again. Their counter-attack play has been absolutely fantastic. Pace really hurts defences, and they've got that in abundance. Well, he took care of it defensively. Not much time to make up his mind. And winning it back. Schlager. And now it's Riddler Baku. Kevin Mbabu crossing possibilities and finishing there with more of a whimper than a bang Derek that reminded me of you finishing like that it's just terrible I wouldn't have done that well <laughs> Angelino moving it forward Nkunku into the advanced position. As clean as a whistle, that challenge. Well, there might well be scope for them to counter-attack here. Good vision. Can he get onto this? It's a good cross. Has to be. 
It's in. They're looking really relaxed and confident and not giving the opposition much of a look in. Well, here's the replay. It's a gorgeous ball over the top. And in the end, it's an easy finish. Lovely goal. Slightly different vantage point in terms of the goal that was scored. So 2-0 now. Kevin Campbell. Andre Silva with it. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. We're now inside the final 20 minutes of the game. Options in the middle. But he dealt with that ball played in rather well. Andre Silva. The ball with Zabitza. Kevin Kumpel. Good movement. And he's taken it away. He's enjoying space. an effective cross aimed at the back post oh tremendous goal technical excellence to finish that one off wonderful to have that in your repertoire well here's the replay and it all starts with the delivery into the box just begging for someone to get on the end of it and then it just gets better and better from there superb Softly passing the volley into the net. Lovely goal. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Only 10 minutes remaining here. Vili Orban. And snuffing out the danger. And it's Maximilian Philip. Cross could be useful and taken away. Andre Silva. They've lost it. Yannick Gerhardt. Good work to regain possession. He's found a pocket of space. If you're wondering about stoppage time, one minute to be added on. And there it is, the final whistle, and it's a victory for the home side. They're going to be happy with this result, Lee. Well, being potent up front gives you a great chance in any game, and they were certainly that today. Sharp, clinical, and exciting to watch for sure. Well, his performance in this particular game will have impressed many people, Lee. Well, he never gave that back line a chance to get a breath. Two goals for the lad today. Played superbly well, looked really sharp, constantly playing on the shoulder of the last defender. A real handful.